Hello gladiators and welcome to the Coliseum. In today's episode we will be game singing. No, I'm kidding. But we are going to go to the next town. Well, we're in the next town, but we're going to explore the next town after we put our beautiful Pico in the PC. Because sadly our beautiful Pico died last episode in a naive attempt of me trying to battle. It must be because I'm a girl and no, I'm not being sexist, but I totally am at the same time. So now we have Mistake, we have Spore, we have Pico the Second, and we have Spurt. His original name was supposed to be Spirit, but I spelt it wrong because I'm retarded. So here we are in the Peace Pokemon Center. We're gonna talk to all the peoples in the Pokemon Center and see what they have to say. Hi, trainer, do you know Pokemon called Unno? Like, that's a Pokemon that I sometimes find when I'm walking. It jumps out of the rest and glass, and you can get lots of experience for it. Okay, I'm done talking to the trainers, they're boring. Hello, how may I help you? We're gonna buy some grape balls and some potions because we are awesome like that. And what would we do without a few healing items because we're gonna be battling a gym leader here soon. Let's see what this guy has. Hello. Hello. You heal on that ball and a bunch of mail. I don't get mail. What is mail for? Well, please, somebody tell me, besides the fact that you use it to talk to your friends over the um, mail when you trade Pokemon, what else is it for? Is there anything? Okay. You know, I'm not going to go through and talk to everybody here because I know somebody you could trade a Pokemon and I think somebody else gives you an item. But that's all I know in this place and I really don't want to give a crap because I don't. Berg used the word two years ago. Yeah, see, all they want to do is talk to me about useless stuff that I don't want to know about. But we are going to catch a new Pokemon in this episode, so let's go and do that because, yeah, I think that feels pretty great right now. Since we lost Pico, I need some recovery. I need somebody to hold me and comfort my sad soul. You're just standing there? You didn't battle me? Yo, Traveling Trainer, are you Pokemon getting stronger here? This might come in handy. Oh, well, thanks. You're sweet. You are awesome. Rock smash. Awesome sauce. And I like that we can teach it to a Pokemon. And the TM will not go away. So let's go click over here to the TM box and use rock smash. Let's see. Power is 40. It's a very weak attack. But it's an attack and that's what counts, right? And assuming we might need it. Ooh, Spirit can learn it. We'll teach it to him. Yes. I also need to look at Spurt's... Um, stats because I don't know I don't I've never used a dusk nor before so all right we talked somebody rock smosh so let us go up and see what spurts status are well he sounded like he totally just farted but let's see he's got a good defense and good special defense okay so he's gonna be my my defense he's gonna be my wall he's got a high attack but not a very special high attack so what does nightshade do it's a special attack the user makes the target see a frightening mirage. It inflicts damage matching the user's level. Okay. That's good to know. Um, let's see. If you go straight, it doesn't take long, but if you go the wrong way, it's a maze. It's Pinwheel Forest, a path or a maze for you. Um, I'm actually not sure because I haven't been in there yet. But we'll go in there soon. Are you going deeper into Pinwheel Forest? Ah, this lady is going to be my hero if we can beat her. <laughs> I'm not positive. I know I'll be able to, but it's still scary. Shiz. I mean, in battling any Pokemon is scary. Let's see. She's got a Muna. That would be perfect for Dust Storm. But we're going to use Mistake, apparently. Because I forgot to switch him out. And he knows Side Beam, so we're definitely not going to use Dust Storm. Well, that was super effective. And it paralyzed. Good, good. I was scared there for a second. But he has synchronized, that's awesome. Fury swipes? Cut! 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 Yeah! Ooh, go! Go, Mistake! I kind of feel bad for naming him Mistake. Actually. Aw, Mistake! Come on. Ooh. 6 HP. Ouch! That hurts! Come on, Muna, don't play this game with me. I think Psybeam might actually hurt Spore a lot, so maybe I shouldn't have brought Spore out. Okay, Spore's got this. Let's see, we'll use a tackle. 
Go score! Oh, come on. I know you- I know you got better than this, man. I know you can do it. Boom. Alright, Luna has fainted. I actually need to look in my DS. Not my DS. I need to look on my phone to see what moves our lovely Dusknor can learn. So I'll have to search while playing. At the same time, isn't that crazy? It's like double tasking mania. Alright, we healed our Pokemon. So we could go down this area right here. Thank you! Alright, let's catch Pokemon! What route are we on? We're on a different route, right? I gotta make sure now. I don't wanna accidentally cheat. Nocrane City and... Pinwheel Forest! Alright, let's see what we can find! No! And it's a Weedle! Really? Really friggin' a Weedle? Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna look up Dusknor's moves. That's terrible. What? What is this? Really? Oh well. Uh, Beedrill, I guess, isn't too bad. I guess. We didn't kill it? Awesome. Alright, one more cut and then we should be able to throw a Pokeball at it and then we should be able to get it. So let's see, I'm gonna look up Dusknor's moves. Let's see. He'll learn Shadow Sneak at level 22 and Pursuit at level 25. Shadow Punch at 37, that's not bad. Alright, let us throw this beautiful red ball at this beautiful golden weedle and hope we become rich with happiness and shit. It should not even... No. It should just not shook at all. It's a freaking weedle. <sighs> And what's up with these grass Pokemon? That has all I've been finding, I swear. It eats its weight and leave every day. It fans off attackers with the needle on its head. It's a hairy bug Pokemon? That's awesome. Uh, let's name it Harry Potter. We'll just name it Potter. Now we'll name it Harry. Harry Potter. It'll fit, right? P-O-T-T-R. Yes, it will. Harry Potter. Ah, uh, the E button and the R button. Yeah, we got Harry Potter. We'll never lose, man. He's got that one move. Actually, I don't watch Harry Potter, so I don't know. <laughs> Alakazam, that's what he has. This is taking longer than expected. So, you guys, my lovely subscribers, I have... Me and my fiance have created a new Nuzlocke challenge. It's called... Well, I'm actually not going to tell you what it's called yet. And actually that video will probably be out before this one. But, just in case... Shiz. Just in case it's not. It's going to be a beautiful new Nuzlocke. And if it's out, it... I hope you guys like it. Because <laughs> I'm not sure if I'll let this video out or that video out first. I haven't decided yet. Because I'm recording this now and I'm uploading the other one now. I need to switch my Pokemon. We have Spirit. He knows what he's doing. And yeah, it's. It, I think it's pretty cool. Me, my fiance started thinking of it and we just kind of added on with his thoughts. So I'm hoping you guys will like it. So let's see, we'll try Nightshade. Cottony. Ooh, that worked, I guess. Weird, Disable, and Rock Smash. I guess Rock Smash would be more effective since technically he has a higher attack, huh? But then it's a grass Pokemon, so it wouldn't really matter either way. I also am learning how to make really cool text in GIMP, and GIMP is a program kind of like Photoshop, except it's free because I'm too poor and I can't afford that crap. So, I made this really cool text for my Nuzlocke. That, I cre that we created, and I can't wait to show you guys because it's so freaking awesome. I was so proud of myself for making it. I don't want to boast. I'm not boasting. I'm just saying it's awesome. All right, we've got a Petalil here. My friend Blackleaf, I think he had one of these. No, Petalil. No, he had a bug Pokemon that was in the name of that same name. Yeah, okay, I'm going to be quiet now because obviously I don't know what I'm talking about. What's up with this leech seed? You don't, you don't need health, it's fine. Just stop it. You're being a jerk. You're gonna make me cry. I like Nightshade though, I guess it's not too bad of a move. 
not very effective because he has a really low special attack, which doesn't make sense because he's a ghost Pokemon and he should have a higher special attack. But that's besides the point. Um, I'm gonna look at his moves really quick. Mr. Harry Potter's, he's got Poison Sting and String Shot. That's awesome. Mm. How about, I don't think we're gonna be able to send out Pico because he doesn't have very many moves. And Spore, we'll do that. And I think I'm gonna take advantage of the fact that we're by a uh, Pokey Lady Girl that'll heal me and I'm gonna grind the heck out of this place. And you guys are stuck watching it. Doesn't that suck? And nobody will die. Not a one. Not a one person. Go, Spore! Spore is absolutely my favorite. Got, she's buff as heck. Those puff balls aren't there for nothing, I'm telling you. Tough trainer. Heal me, woman. And then get back in that kitchen. Make me sandwich. I'm gonna bring Harry Potter out to the front because I want... Well... Let's actually bring Spurt out to the front because he's gonna be our best bet against this gym leader. So I'm gonna go off on a grinding montage and explore Pinwheel right here and we will be back.
Mistake! No! No, anybody but Mistake! Oh my gosh, guys, I just lost Mistake! Oh, I know I lost Harry Potter earlier, but Mistake, you can't lose Mistake, holy crap! I suck at this! Oh, well, these guys are really kicking my butt. I mean, I thought I was good at Pokemon, but I am apparently not very good at it. When you play a Nuzlocke like this, it's like, holy crap. And I'm hoping that rock types are not effective against ghosts, because that would suck. Ooh, it is. Ooh, but it's not very effective. Why didn't I just use him the whole time? I was scared that he would, um, it'd be super effective, but oh my gosh, I can't believe I just lost Mistake. I'm so close! Mistake could have evolved or something, and then she could have went down. Oh man. And then Pico almost dies, and Spore is like my only. Spore almost died here. I mean, it was super effective. Holy crap. It's because freaking that Pokemon got a freaking critical. I hate this game. I hate white and black. They suck. White and black and black and white too. They're just no bueno. I do have to come back up here and finish grinding a little bit. I do need to get my levels way up because of the gym leader coming up and obviously I just lost another Pokemon. So I'm just not gonna make it through this thing. I will try my best. Dude, that's pretty. But I can't promise nothing. I'm running from this son of a biscuit. Thank you. So I guess we'll go drop off our beautiful Pokemon and I will finish grinding and then we will just have to finish the episode there because holy crap, two Pokemon in a grinding session because apparently I'm not good at this. Uh, it was both critical hits, I think. Weedle actually, I think she just died because I think it just happened, but Pico died. He would have stayed alive if it wouldn't have been a critical, but it was a critical hit. Bad things went down, so we have- look at that! We already have our first starter in there. Now we have our shiny Harry Potter. And I have to put Mistake in here, too. That is- I have three Pokemon, and there's no way to catch another one. Oh my gosh. I am so sorry, guys. I need to quit killing you off, and I will love you more and forevermore. So anyway, I'm gonna end the episode here, gonna grind a little bit more, so thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you next episode where we, I think, will be facing the gym leader. Woohoo!